Hi everyone, it's Crew Sale, and I'm here with some more Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. A hero just came out on Tuesday, so as I did with Joker, I want to show off a little bit of his gameplay. Um, but I also want to find the hero that really suits me. I, I'm trying to. I watched uh, Sakurai Sensei's uh, discussion of hero. So you got Eleven. You've got what was his name? I forget actually. Uh, I believe this guy was Solo. Maybe this guy was solo, and this guy was eight. Um, let's play as this one. Uh, it doesn't really change the moveset, but it's kind of fun to have a character that you really want to play. Um, and since I have no idea how to play this guy, let's just... Let's take it nice and easy for now. Actually, you know, no, that's not really. Let's pump it up to 3.5. Make this a little bit difficult. Okay. Ha, ah, I get it. It's like the slimes. Hmm. There's that crit. Oof, well, that was explosive. <laughs> All right. Not bad, not bad. Okay, versus Hero and Robin. Robin is mimicking the uh, spellcaster who you can actually, oh. So it's a little bit like Pikachu's Thunderbolt attack. Ow. Freaking Nosferatu. Ow. I love the Sky Whale. It's not a JRPG without a Sky Whale. Okay, this is getting a little nuts. Oof. Oh, it's neat. Whoops. I was not paying attention to that. Let's reset. That was that was bad. That was not that was not the best. Let's try that again. There we go. Alright, not too bad, not too bad. Same results as last time, so I can't really complain too much about that. Ah, huh, well that's fun. Oh, I don't have any MP left. Whoops. Well, that worked. That went much better than the last time. I'm trying to also figure out, okay, so he's got that leap over like Link does, which is nice, but 
I don't know, he's, he's definitely a different feel. And I understand that Sakurai built him in with a lot of sort of random elements, stuff that made it so that when you, uh, when you fight with him, you gotta be ready for some random elements to happen, like the critical hits, the command list. But overall, he seems like a very fun character. A nice blend of magic and sword play. So he's got sort of the feel of Robin and also of uh, a little bit of Corrin. He's also got sort of the Zelda elemental aspect, which, you know, you know, I like I like to play my Zelda. Ay ay ay. There we go. Also feeling really good because I finally got myself a, an adapter so I could play with my GameCube controllers, so got that good old GameCube feel. What the heck? Seriously? Yeah, boy. When in the air, always aim for the Rathlos' tail. They actually did stuff to mimic the uh, the concept of a pitfall trap and a flash bomb. There we go. All right, that's fair. Wasn't my best showing, I guess. Now, who's Pikachu supposed to mimic in this? Oh boy. I'm actually really glad that I watched Sakurai's video because I wouldn't have known to charge up my spell. Cheesed it a little bit, but I was getting a little too close for comfort there. Yeah, well. Still 0.5, so not bad, not bad. Interesting that they all seem to have different abilities. Take that. So hits and also just time rebuild your MP, which is nice. It's fun. It's got that classic RPG feel to it. Oh, there we go. All right. Oh, yeah. Now there's this. Thank you. 
Wow. Oh boy. Uh, much as I'd like to gather those, I don't think I've got enough time. There we go. Alright, me versus Robin. There we go. What the? Well, it's I guess it's called Dragon Quest for a reason. Ow. Nice. Gotta love that critical hit. Alright, not bad. Not bad. Okay, so overall, I like Hero. Um, definitely, I feel like the crits were definitely prevalent throughout, um, so that was fun. Uh, what else? What else did I notice? Uh, I like his spells. They have a nice, a nice feel to them. Very nice feel, actually. Just very, I don't know. They don't feel so bulky. They have sort of this, like I said, they sort of have the Zelda feel to them, which actually really appeals to me. They, they have a nice hit range. They have nice explosive effects. Um, I like the charge up on them. The charge up is nice. Feels very well timed. Feels feels like it's really just functioning properly, which is good. Especially on release, it feels good that he feels. And I've heard complaints about how oh, it's uh, you know, there's too much random stuff for a fighting for a uh, professional or a uh, tournament ready fighting game. That's not exactly what people are looking for, kind of thing. Which yeah, I I guess I get that. But as also was stated by those who responded to. The, uh, that statement. This was not originally supposed to be a fighting game, or a competitive fighting game, I should say. It's supposed to be a fun game where you just play your favorite characters. So, in that front, I definitely agree, and so I have no problems with Hero having the critical hit windows, and uh, the... and also, I actually liked his command list. His command list was kind of fun, though. I need to actually take some time to learn what the different commands do. That's for sure. What else? Um, his sword attacks are nice. He's definitely got sort. Of, he's, he's built around uh, Link in a lot of his attacks, but I think that also just comes down to having to learn about the different styles that he's got or the different attacks he's got. I didn't really do much but sort of button mash during that run through, which you know is kind of just what you'd expect for the most part, on the first try. It is what it is. Definitely want to play more of him. Definitely want to play more of Hero. Feel serve. I definitely like the, the fighters that have a blend of magic and uh, and sword play to them. That's why I like Korn and why I like... Well, actually, I'm not the biggest fan of Robin. Uh, not, not because he's a bad character, he or she, whichever gender you choose. Um, it, it's more just that I... I can't get around the whole use up the spells. I mean, actually, I guess that's not fair to say because also I have to deal with that with Hero because his, of his MP gauge. So, yeah. I mean... But, at, actually, in comparison with Robin, 
you've got the uh, issue of how Robin's air slap or his uh, up B actually has a very small hit range. It's great for actually trying to beat down guys from above. Oh, nice. Um, it feels like Heroes has a more defensive range to it. Overall, yeah, it just seems like you can use it to knock people around. You can also use it the same way Robin does. If you're falling with a guy, you can actually use it to block recovery to the or an ledge grab, which seems pretty cool. Um, what else? What else am I noticing here? I think actually, yeah, that is. I think that's about everything I can think of with Hero. And that was a good run through, everyone. I think that is a good first showing of Hero and what he can do. If you like the character and haven't bought him yet, please do. I mean, definitely support Super Smash Brothers. It's a great game, and yeah, the roster's building up. And we've got Banjo and Kazooie to look forward to in the fall, so I will be back when they come out with another vid. And hopefully a few more vids of just me and the guys playing around a bit. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you for the next one.